Businesses are gearing up for the Ohio to go up even more. This is what Cunningham's on River Road looked like yesterday. They were putting up sandbags and other barricades to try to stop the water. The owner says they learned how to prepare after severe flooding a few years ago. Now the bar and parts of the walls are removable so they can be put into dry storage. Captain's Quarters up the road also has plenty of experience with flooding. The restaurant posted this video of how high the water was yesterday. And you could see the water already covered the decks and the patio was getting up to the doorways. The restaurant was planning to open March 1st after being closed for the winter. As you can see, their plans have changed. Pretty crazy to see. And Alden, it stopped raining for a few days. So why are these levels still going up? Well, there's a delay, Daniel. So just because the rain stopped doesn't mean that the threat of flooding has gone away. The Ohio River is the main body of water that channels a lot of the uh, other bodies of water in our area through the what we call a watershed. So every area here in this dark green eventually funnels into the Ohio River. So what happens when we have heavy rain either upstream or anywhere else, it eventually funnels down into the river and it takes a while. So once it does reach the Ohio or any other body of river, it kind of piles up and then that surge of water makes its way down the river and and that's how you end up with flooding even days after the fact when you have heavy rain. So it's not until that water and that surge of water finally moves on by that we see those flood levels begin to recede. And 